Welcome to the Cutting Edge Health Podcast. I'm Jane Rogers. Alzheimer's strikes women more often than men. Two-thirds of all Alzheimer's patients are women. Research is showing it is just plain smart to be on bioidentical hormone replacement therapy if you want to protect against cognitive decline. Dr. Lisa Broyles is a functional medicine MD who appears often on the Cutting Edge Health Podcast. In this episode, we take a deep dive into bioidentical hormone replacement therapy for both men and women. Estrogen helps to prevent the you getting an aneurysm in the first place, which is really exciting. Most people don't know that about estrogen. It also, estrogen, when it gets incorporated into the LDL cholesterol particle, prevents oxidation of the LDL particle, meaning that the damaging form of cholesterol to the arteries is lessened with estrogen. So there's that the vascular benefit affects cognition, but you also have estrogen receptors all throughout the brain. So your your forebrain, your pituitary, which is responsible for talking to the thyroid, the hypothalamus and the amygdala, which are the first parts of the brain that are affected by al- Alzheimer's, all of these parts of the brain have estrogen receptors. So we have proven through PET scans that women that are on hormone therapy have much higher signal intensity in those parts of the brain on hormone therapy versus off of it. Okay. So it's very important to have the estrogen uh, to reach each part of the brain. And it Mm -hmm. actually increases what we call neurogenesis, which is the neurons making more of themselves. So you have increased neuron production and decreased breakdown of the neurons you have. Estrogen also increases the synaptic transmission, which I think of like a radio with some fuzz. And if you tune that radio just right, this shows my age, right? Because nobody uses radios these days. But but if you tune it just right, then that fuzz goes away and your signal is much clearer. And that's what estrogen does. It increases the strength of that synaptic signal so that your neurons can talk to each other better. But something that even when you're perimenopausal and you're approaching menopause, if you're mm-hmm. starting to have symptoms where your periods are getting erratic, you're not sleeping as well, you're feeling more anxious, maybe you're feeling a bit more forgetful, that's the time to talk to your doctor about hormone therapy because the studies show the sooner that you start it, the better you're going to do as far as your cognition. The women that start it right away when they go through menopause and stay on hormone therapy for those first 10 10 years between ages 50 to 60 consistently Mm -hmm. have less risk of developing Alzheimer's dementia than those that aren't on it at all or that started after that 10-year period.